hi guys welcome back to my channel today we are talking about hair and more hair because we all have some hair and if you're new to my channel welcome and if you haven't subscribed to my channel what are you waiting on smash that subscribe button below and turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss another upload and so you get all my uploads thank you and if you're here riding out the way with me thank you thank you for returning to the family now guys let's jump into our video guys like i said i am going to talk about hair and more hair and as you can see in the title oh, we are going to focus on low porosity and that is because your girl right here is it suffers from low porosity if you want to call it that my hair is not that porous right but some of us might be wondering and for the record for those who don't know your porosity is has to do with you know how porous your hair is its ability that is to absorb moisture it's simple as that and guys you know that moisture is super important for your hair without moisture you will have your hair becoming dry and breaking and it break and that is why sometimes our hair breaks so much because it lacks something and some most in most cases it's moisture so you might not know and if you don't know how to determine you know your hair porosity you can do a simple test which is you grab a glass of water yes it's that easy <laughs> you grab a glass of water you and you pull or pluck yes a strand of your hair and you just put it in that water if that hair is trying to sink to the bottom of the water it means that your hair is high porosity so it absorbs moisture so quickly you know and easily if it's in the middle you know that it's normal it has a balance right there however if after five minutes of doing all of this you recognize that your hair is still at the top of that glass yes <laughs> then uh, you know that you are you or your hair is um has a low porosity that is it does not absorb moisture much and that is what we are here to talk about and how do we deal with this how do we handle all of this you know like for some of us we recognize how dry our hair is and it doesn't matter what we put into our hair it is still dry it is because you are suffering from maybe low porosity so you need to do the test to determine don't just determine and if you don't do the test there are other factors that you can you know use to determine you know what is going on with your hair so I was and I, guys I can go to a backstory to share with you how I re re actually reached to this point of knowing that yes I have low porosity I remember when I perm back my hair you know if, and two weeks later I was told to do a protein treatment and guys um, I did that protein treatment and I tell you, my hair was so dry and I was with a very professional salon and they were trying everything to determine what causes that they could not find out. They didn't know. And, you know, in Jamaica, we just say, okay, we go to one, get a hairdresser. And she actually helped me to get some moisture, but it was not staying and I just couldn't understand. And I just started researching all of this. Like, I need to know what is going on with my hair, you know? And let me tell you, here is your beauty, trust me. And sometimes we don't really take that time out to really care for our hair. So in this little video, please take care of your hair. You can't say I didn't tell you, take care of your hair. It is so important. So that was how I started researching and then I recognized that I'm protein sensitive. And that is one of the way you can determine also that you are low porosity. Your hair doesn't like protein most if not all low porosity hair don't do well with protein people who have high porosity protein is their thing sister yes it belongs to them sister so make them have it have it all you want there have it all you want yes it belongs to them but for us girls yes for us we need to deep condition our hair 
like on a regular basis we need deep conditioning is our best friend and we need heat 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 and more heat in our hair in order to get that moisture out so you need to be steaming your hair like yes 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 girl you need to steam your hair so that you can retain the moisture in your hair and in retaining moisture you know you indeed retain growth but if your hair is dry 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 like my granny that's say coconut brush then rest assured that breakage 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 is going to happen and i know you don't want that i don't want that and that's why i want to share this you know with you all especially my female my female family here yes i want to share it with you all to say that you know you have to add moisture to your hair by deep conditioning your hair also whenever you're going to style your hair or in the week if you want to you know treat your hair again to something to retain some moisture or something of that sort you need to use warm to hot water that's what i use in my hair i have to use warm to hot water before i add my leave-in conditioner to my hair because if i just use cold water on my hair what i am doing i am sealing the cuticle and you know with low porosity maybe you don't know but i'm telling you if you have low porosity here your cuticles is already tight so if you put cold water on your hair you're further sealing it so to open up the cuticles and to allow it to absorb the moisture what you need to do you need to add warm to hot water so when you add that warm to hot water to your hair then you can add your your leave-in conditioner yes your leave-in conditioner of choice you add that to your hair and then you seal it with your oil and i know some people is going to say wait oil is a moisturizer in my book oil is a sealant and not a moisturizer if you add oil to your hair it trust me i'm telling you the next two days hair dry 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 like as must say my granny that said coconut brush yes so when, what you need to do is either use water first or if you don't are your moisturize um your leave-in conditioner if you don't have a leave-in conditioner a cream or a butter just use your water then you add the oil so that your hair you know can keep all that moisture in moisture is super 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 duper important for us girls who have low porosity hair like i said give them them protein make them keep it over there and let we hold on to the moisture the deep conditioner because that's what you're hearing in that's what you requires and the next thing guys when you have low porosity here this is a situation i can tell you that will always happen your hair will readily built up with products that you use so using just a regular conditioner and just wash your hair is not enough it I said it again it's not enough you need to get yourself a clarifying shampoo and at least clarify your hair even once or twice per month if you can do that once or twice if you can do twice per month do that once per month or every other week or something just do it your hair is going to thank you because what this will do it will strip the build up products from your hair and then allow you to easily apply moisture to your hair so your hair will retain that moisture so again guys i'm telling you if you like me have a low price to hair these are some little tips that i want to share with you how to care for your hair you know because your hair is is your beauty and just like we care for everything else as it relates to us and as an individual we need to care for our hair and we only truly care for our hair properly when we know you know the type of hair we have or how porous our hair is that will help us to determine the types of product that we need to put in our hair so we won't have to say oh girl here look nice slick and nice and she used the product as a mega child yes he girl here slick and nice 
But guess uh, your era say yo move that, take it over there, put it over there. That's not my thing. That's not my style. Me no want it. You know that kind of thing that you hear is saying I don't want it. Remove it. Put it one side or whatever. So you have to know what your hair wants and give your hair what it wants. And this is what I have to say in a nutshell about low to hair guys i am on a natural hair journey so join me in my journey here on my channel yes i'm not wearing my hair Definitely. today coming out more with my hair sharing uh, you know my hair care tips and products that i use in my hair for listening to me thank you guys i appreciate you so much thank you yes thank you for listening to me thank you for always coming back thank you for riding out the wave riding out the wave with me I appreciate it so 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 much yes 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 so much you know your girl you know your girl love you all thank you bye